when broiler farmers raise broiler chickens the first thing on their mind is how they can ensure the broilers reach the highest possible weight within the shortest time possible and on this video i'm not only going to tell you the means i will show you how to apply it so that you get the desired result asap so and don't forget to stay till the end because there are some secrets i exposed in between the videos what's up my people and welcome to my youtube channel life of a farmer loaf where we discuss farming in deltas i remain your anchor ishokri of okironye and you can call me of orange so if this is your first time of seeing my video and those that do just watch and leave please just click the subscribe button and the bell icon so that you won't miss any future videos also like share across all social media platform so that we can reach a larger audience and to all my old and new subscribers thank you so much you mean a lot to me without wasting your time let's dive into the main cocoa before you use any organic growth promoter for your boilers you have to ask yourself these three questions one is it cheap two is it readily available and three is it easy to use and maybe a fourth one which i can say does it serve as medicinal purpose this organic group promoter ticks all boxes and it is called halt red pepper capsicum anum i introduced it to someone and he said there is no significant difference that he didn't see any results when i asked him how he used it i discovered that he administered it wrongly this is why i took it as a pain to give you details of how to apply it i have used it and it worked for me so i'm spilling out the secret but first let's discuss what makes it a growth booster and why it is best for your boiler beds there are numerous reasons I will list just few. Red hot pepper has capsaicin, which is the main active compound responsible for the pungent effect of various species of the hot red peppers and the main components including hot taste. This capsaicin is an important alkaloid due to its neurotomic and antimicrobial activity. It's getting interesting at this point now because research has shown that capsaicinoids had shown many biochemical and pharmacological properties which included antioxidants due to its rich source of carotenoids such as vitamin c and vitamin e and even pro vitamin e you see it and it can potentiate the activities of pancreatic and intestinal enzymes it can also increase bile acid secretion and increase body weight gain in boilers chicken Hot red pepper is rich in vitamin C, hence it is very good to control heat stress, especially during the hot period. Capsaicin increases appetite in broilers, so by the time you add the hot red pepper to the diet, it influences their feed consumption of the boiler as well as feed conversion efficiency. So you now see why it is very important for your base. And sometimes you will ask yourself, is it not going to be hot for the boilers like it does to humans? Well, it won't and maybe it's because um, boilers you know they lack um, a kind of receptors that are specific for capsaicin binding thereby enabling a high concentration of capsaicin in boiler diets so you can increase it to as high as zero from um, 0 0.5 to 1.5 percent well this hot red pepper is also known to contain taponoid compounds capsaicin which has antibacterial properties as a bactericidal effect against intestinal pathogens such as Escherichia coli, Salmonella species, and Clostridium species. And before I go further, let me ship a little secret here for layer farmers. But first, please click the subscribe button and the bell icon. Thanks for doing that. Studies have shown that hot red pepper helps to significantly enhance and also darken the yolk color and improve laying performance. It also improves gut integrity. So talking about gut, if you haven't watched my video of the function and how to build your boiler's gut then you won't understand this particular aspect just try to watch it and the inclusion level for layers is at 0.5 percent looking at these benefits of red hot pepper is available in all homes one begins to wonder why most farmers are not using it i will give you the answer it's either they don't know 
how to apply it or they don't know when to use it well before i go further i want to plead with you please if you are watching this video and you know you haven't subscribed to my channel just click the subscribe button click the bell icon so that you get notification anytime i upload a video and please also like share and drop your questions in the comment section thank you very much this will not cost you any money but it will only help me to reach a larger audience thank you and god bless you to use hot red pepper for better result you have to air dry or you sun dry it or you oven dry it then you blend or grind it to powder form and keep in airtight container during usage the range of measure is between 0.5 gram to 1.5 gram to a kilogram of feed that is assuming i i choose to use 0.5 gram then in every one kg i will add 0.5 and in every 100 kg i will add 50 gram of hot red pepper let's assume my boilers consumes 70 kilogram of feed per day then i will need to add 35 grams of hot red pepper it's that simple if you choose to use one gram per kg of feed that means in every 10 kg of feed you add 10 gram of hot red pepper and if your best consumes 70 kg 100 kg or 150 kg it will be 70 gram 100 gram or 150 gram respectively ideally it's best to start administering hot red pepper as from three weeks of age till maturity but for me in my own way what i do is that at zero eight or upon the arrival of the best till six days i administer at a rate of 0.2 gram per kg of feed then from this day seven till day 13 i will now increase it to 0.3 gram per kg of feed and from day 14 to day 20 i increase it to 0.5 gram and from 21 days i can then choose to either give my beds one gram or 1.5 gram per kg of feed the essence of me doing this is one to avoid excess says weights at a very young age because when you administer it for them once the the ratio is too much for them the the internal organs will not be able to process it thereby you now have cases of sudden death syndrome or overweight as a result the legs might not be able to hold the weight of the body so that is why i use that pattern for my base and the last thing but not the least which i want to tell you is please and please subscribe to my channel click the bell icon like share and drop your questions in the comment section see you in my next video peace out